I, I dropped out of school in a third grade, and I had to go to work to help take care of younger sisters and brothers. I also was told that I wasn't going to get my high school diploma. I was going to get a certificate stating I attend a high school, not I complete a high school. And I was interested because my children. I didn't think of me. I didn't thought about me. Uh, when we talk about great things happening in Durham, certainly one of the great things that's happening in Durham is the Durham Literacy Center. And I've got to tell you, you don't find people more committed to a mission that is more important anywhere on the planet. And, you know, I'm thankful for it because to find somebody that really, that willing to put that time together and help, you know, somebody like me, because I always felt like I didn't have education. I was nothing. I was nobody. So I discovered that you don't, you don't have to know everything, but you give what you have. You teach what you know. I learned from the Teen Career Academy that whatever you want in life, you have to work hard for it. For every story you heard today, there are thousands of Durham residents. 20% of the Durham community is functionally illiterate. They don't have basic literacy skills. In the same way that we all revere medicine and selfless doctors who give of themselves and rescue people, children, people we know all over the world, this literacy center is rescuing people in a very similar way. Education really is the key to unlocking the poverty in Durham, and we need your help. Because, you know, I think I used to always say I'm nothing, but now I feel like I'm somebody.